Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. This video, I'm gonna show you how you can remix a project in Scratch. So for example, you might come across a project that you really like, but you want to change it in a different way. So here's a project that I made on my old account, DT Technology. So it's a moving maze game. So you move the uh, sprite with the arrow keys. If you touch the wall, then it sends you back to the beginning. Now you might be playing through this and go, hmm, this is a little too difficult. So I'm gonna make my own version of this, or I'm gonna add in more levels. So you can press this remix button right here and it'll save a copy of this. So that way you can change it to do whatever you want. Or you can go to C inside and click the remix button right here. So Clicking that button saves us as a copy. So now all the changes that I make are gonna be in my own version of this project. And now I can actually go into here and start changing things around. So I can read the comments, I can look at the code, and I can start going, hmm, my character's moving really fast. I want it to move really slow up and down. So I'm gonna make it so that it goes by one and minus one. So now when I press up and down arrow, this is how fast it's moving. Uh, maybe you don't want that. Or maybe under the levels code, you might wanna be like, hmm, this is moving too much. So I'm gonna change this to like 0.5 and 0.5 and 0.5. And let's see how that changes that very first level. So we press the green flag and we're going through. Now it's moving slower. So notice how when I was remixing this project, I was making a change and then testing it out in the actual project. So when you're remixing something, experiment by changing the numbers, maybe experiment by putting things in different order and see what happens doing that, or maybe even get rid of stuff and see what happens. And if it breaks things, you can always just put it back to where it was or close to where it was, or you can go to edit and restore something that you might've deleted. And if you break it where it's something like this, you can always look at the original project by going to your C project page and then clicking up here where it has the original project link. So that is uh, how you can remix some projects. Simply click on the remix button, it saves your own copy and experiment by uh, adding in new blocks, changing the different parameters and by adding in some new code to make it do new things. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org where you can also learn about our high quality professional development.